Hello, this is Pamela. Welcome to my channel. Grab you a cup of coffee, sit back and relax, and enjoy some good old yarny talk. Hello, this is Pamela, and you are on Pamela's Adoring Crochet. I'd like to say welcome to my channel. Uh, today, or this morning, I am drinking some good old uh, caramel coffee. It's um, black coffee, but it's caramel flavored. And um, I'd like to say thank you to all of my new subscribers, and I hope you enjoy the channel. Um, and thank you to all my returning subscribers for sticking with me. And thank you to all of my new members of my channel. I appreciate all of you guys so very much. And the comments. I love the comments. Well, today's video is um, I wanted to show off of three finished objects. So let's go ahead and get started on the first one. so I've got it put up here um, I end up doing 24 squares uh, they're about 10 inch a piece some are a little larger some may be a tad smaller but they're uh, basically about 10 inches a piece I did 12 increase and then 12 decrease so and like I said 24 I have not measured this thing yet but yeah, there it is. And this was going to be a Christmas present. Hey lady. Hey there girl. Hey there. She's like, mama, I want to appear with you, mama. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and get this thing. What'd you think? <laughs> I finally finished it. Um, that will be a Christmas gift and I used an eye hook for that project and I do have a tutorial for that. So um, now I've got to get it in the wash, get it all cleaned up, um, get it packed up and you know put away for a Christmas gift. <laughs> but that's one Christmas gift checked off my list and I have two more to check off my list. Let me put my coffee down. And let me show you this. This is, um, well, yeah, this one here is going to be, it's a small basket. And it's to put some makeup in for a teenage girl to go in her bedroom. Her bedroom is black and white. And so I made this little basket. Um, I believe I did eight rounds. And um, I don't remember how many I did here. Um, well, I can count. Let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. I did a total of 12 rounds for the wall, including the handle. Um, but like I said, her room is black and white. And I am putting her some makeup, some Ulta. No, not Ulta. Um, makeup from that I've gotten throughout the year from Ipsy. I'm going to go in there and pull out, you know, some lotion, uh, mascara, some eyeshadow, lip gloss and things like that and I'm going to fill this up with makeup and then this will be a little basket so she can have on her dresser okay the other thing that I made to go with this little basket is oh yeah some of you guys have asked how I got this to where it stands up so good uh, my sister Tanya taught me how to do that um, it's I have a tutorial on this by the way but not the small size um, that's why I was telling you how many rounds I did for the small um, what you do is every time you do your single crochet, you put your hook in, grab the yarn, pull through, and then grab the yarn and make your single crochet. And then you take that yarn and, and, and tighten it. 
and then you do the next stitch, finish out your single crochet, and then pull your yarn and tighten it. And that's how you get each of the stitches so tight where they stand up really good. And it works even on the bigger ones too. Um, they stand up really well. Okay, so the next thing that I have made uh, as it is, is, I made a pair of slippers. So let me show you the pair that I have on, or the other half of this that I have on. If I can get my foot up here, guys. <laughs> there it is. She wears a size six, six and a half, something like that. And so this is the small size um, slipper. But yeah, <laughs> so I made that. Um, that's actually all that I have made is... Um, just those two things. <laughs> but I worked really hard. Oh, I know what it is, why it seems like I didn't, that I should have more done, is I did finish working on um, a pattern that I have. And I just want to say thank you, Lori, and thank you, uh, Margie, for helping me with that pattern for Crochet Foundry. I appreciate that very much. Um, so I worked on that, and now i got to do the second half of that pattern. It's going to be a washcloth with a holiday mat, a holiday washcloth and a holiday uh, table mats. So, um, be sh so be sure and look forward to that. That will be out in a couple of months. I'm looking forward to that. So today I will be working on that. Um, and this, um, as you remember, I have this pattern right here out of the little doll outfit here. It's a dress with, um, a little matching sweater. Well, I started on my 14 inch last night and I got one little shoe done. <laughs> Well, it's not done. I got. I still have to do the strap like I did right here. So, um, and I may, I'm not even sure if I'm going to do a strap. Because I think I did go up a row too many. So, um, I'm not sure how I may end up completing hers. But it's going to be similar to this. I don't know if you can see that, but it's got the little bobbles around the bottom of the skirt there. And hers is going to be in the peach tones, and you know, as her colors. And if you like this cardigan I'm wearing, this is a Bag o Day cardigan. I will leave the link below. Crystal, she designed this. She's a wonderful designer. And um, yeah, this is one of her patterns. Isn't it beautiful? And this is the same yarn that she used in her tutorial. So it is one of my favorites. Um, so yeah, I'll leave her link below. Go check her out. She has hundreds upon hundreds of tutorials. Anything that you want, you're going to find it on her channel. So, um, go check out Crystal from Bag All Day. So, yeah, guys, that's what I've gotten done so far uh, is the blankets finished. Um, the Oh, and I'll leave links below to everything that I talk about uh, so that you can easily find them. Oh, yeah, I know what I'm doing. I am starting, I'm fixing to make, this is Colorina, 80% acrylic, 20% wool. It's from Hobie. Um, I'm going to make an infinity scarf. I already have a tutorial for this, um, and I'm going to make, so I'm going to make it in this color right here. Isn't it pretty? I have two of these. So I'm, I'm really hoping, I'm pretty sure, I'm about 100% positive, I may be able to get two out of this. So I will put, keep one for myself, and I will put one up for sale in my Etsy shop. My other infinity scarf sold really fast, so, um, I'm going to put another one of those up. <laughs> Except that this has a little wool. Not everybody can wear wool. But I thought this would be, per it says 20% virgin wool. But I thought this would be really, really good for the winter coming up. Um, one done with a little bit of wool in it. <laughs> Wise words. Do not believe every spirit, but test the spirits whether they are of God, because many false prophets have gone out into the world. That's 1 John 4, 1. Infinite One, your power knows no limits or boundaries. Your wisdom constantly counsels me, leading me into truth. Your love follows me all the days of my life. I could go on about how you lead, love, and strengthen me in every area of life. Lord, I am thankful that you give us the ability to distinguish the spirits behind every movement. I won't fool myself into thinking that a feeling is enough. The fruit of a life or ministry is the clue to know whether it's aligned with you or not. 
God, as I seek you, I will not be afraid of falling prey to false doctrine or prophets. Knowing that you are the ultimate leader, help me to keep your law of love in mind when I test the fruit of different ministries. Thank you that in you I know the truth, and the truth sets me free. Do you trust that you are able to test whether a teaching is from God or not? This was a really good one. Wise words. Okay, guys, that's um, all that I have for this video. I'm not really sure if I'll do a video tomorrow. I have a um, board meeting at my church tonight. Um, I have, well, after editing this video, then I have a board meeting. I have my grandson this evening. He's staying the night. I'll have him all day Tuesday. Um, so unless I can get... Do, do some filming for Tuesday's video. There won't be one till Wednesday. And I noticed I have a lot of carts on Facebook that you guys are posting for the Whip Caddy Wednesday. I look forward to that. Um, so I will probably work on that, um, the Wednesday video, Tuesday night, and then get up and film um, Wednesdays. But, um, um, I guess that's all that I have. Um, just remember to live life, have fun, and don't quit. Whatever you're doing, don't quit. Just keep it up, guys. Just keep it up. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe.